guest was tonight. I have know, to say looking that. at that. I mean, that, that, that's so tragic because that's probably the last take that tribute act where there was five. <laughs> yes, that's right. <laughs> you know, if you're in a take that tribute group, now you must be thinking we'll be going to gigs on bicycles soon. Yeah. There'll just be two of us left. <laughs> so, as Matt was saying, we've got uh, Ben in tonight who's going to show us how to yeah. iron. It's you against me. How's your ironing skills? Uh, my ironing skills are fantastic. Okay. Are you joking? No. I mean, my ironing, you know, I, when I got married, the first thing that surprised me about living with a woman is Melanie irons underwear. She ironed My mum does that as yeah, well. Yeah, ironing Fox, underwear. Nick, that, that's that's amazing, isn't it? <laughs> I said, you don't have to iron. It's underwear, I'll stretch it when I put it on. You don't have to iron that. Yeah, but it looks nice in the drawer. It looks nice in the drawer. Yeah. Doesn't it? Well, that's a good point. That yeah, is a good the point. amount of times I've said to people, come and see me undies, look yeah. at them, they look lovely. <laughs> <laughs> so, John, of all the things, all the jobs around the house, what is your best domestic uh, skill? Dog walking. Oh, yeah. That is uh, not a domestic skill, John. Oh, well, you, le you have a dog in the house and don't take it for a walk and you'll wish you had a good dog. <laughs> <laughs> well, domestic material uh, is always coming up in your tours and on your, you know, in your shows. And we don't know who's promoting this new tour that you've got, but we're pretty sure that you'll make sure you get paid for it in the end, right? Mm. Mm. Well, sadly, that didn't happen. On, uh, that was on the Great Barrier Reef, and we got these marine biologists who said, we're going to take you somewhere that's spectacular and it's great into an island. We got there and there was no island, and I thought, we've got these right pair of rogues. Because <laughs> when you meet them, like most Aussies, they just don't look like professors. They no. look like they fell right out the pub, and I thought, we've been really stitched up. And then the water just fed away, and the island amazed. It was superb for six hours, and then it went again. Yeah. You call it supersonic, this tour. Yeah. Is that a reference to how fast your children have grown up? Because we were just saying there, weren't we, Nat, but they're off to university They're off, now. they're gone. It's, yeah, I mean, it really, you know what? I didn't realise the significance. I just came up with the title because you want one word that sounds good. Mm. We used to use the word supersonic in our house. I used to say, look, do it quick, do it supersonic. It was like when I'm playing with the kids. Yeah. And in many respects, yeah, they've grown up that fast. And they're gone. They're gone. I mean, like, they're not, they're not kids anymore. In fact, one of them's not even a teenager, he's 20. So I've got two teenagers and a bloke. I, <laughs> it is, it was really odd. I, 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 I've reached a point in my life where I actually own a man. Which, I, mean, <laughs> I, you know what I, mean? I never thought that would happen. And are they going to come and see you? doing these arena gigs? Uh, well, probably the two have gone to university. Yeah. Because yeah. they'll, they'll get fed. <laughs> 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 and they'll probably come look around and go, can I have a few quid, Dad, and can I have a pizza? So yeah. that, that'll be the, their motivation for being there. Brilliant. You're doing these um, warm-up gigs up and down the country. Yeah. So he thought, as a warm-up now, because there's about four million-ish <laughs> people cruel. watching, if there's a gag you think, will it, won't it work, you can have a go now, if you fancy it. <laughs> <laughs> You've seen my material. It wouldn't make it wouldn't make the one show at seven o'clock. <laughs> Keep it clean. Fair I'll listen. Enough. I'll give it a go. Let's see if we. <laughs> yeah, yeah, all right. There's two <laughs> nuns walking. No, listen. Hang on. <laughs> you asked him. You asked him. John Supersonic Tours starts on October the 22nd oh. in Plymouth. Now, earlier on, we introduced you to ex-Royal Marine 